right? Incorporated in the, the piece itself. So if you look along here, they're actually bag juice bags lining the piece. So what we do is that you take the bag juice bags, you use a glue gun and you stick it and you secure it onto the canvas, right? And then you use a molding paste, which is um, almost like putty, which you put over the canvas, um, over the bag juice bag, um, to make it durable and to make sure that you know you can actually paint on it. It creates a really good painting surface for the bag juice bag. Right? So all of these pa paintings are actually done by students at this school and it actually goes towards raising um, awareness on plastic pollution and also raising funds for the student welfare and as well as scholarships for students at this school. Um, and if you look at any of the pieces and you see textural on any of them, it's actually bag juice bags. So, you know, a lot of people come in here and they're kind of shocked to see so many. They're, they're shocked to see the actual bag juice bags are in the pieces because they don't see it. And that's the whole point of this exhibition, to use the bags in a very effective way. Art Exe could not happen without our sponsors. So I'd just like to take the time out to just thank our sponsors. Firstly, I'd like to thank Marley Coffee, Recover Brands, who actually gave us some of the eco bags where eight plastic bottles are actually in each bag. Super value for kindly giving us the boards and actually building them and doing them for us. CPJ, Lasco, Best Dress, Lithographic, Five Gyros for just the moral support, also for providing information on plastic pollution. I'd also like to thank um, Teen Vibe as well as SRAM. Thank you to SRAM for doing so much of the social, social media marketing as well as the videography the interviews as well. 